All right, let's try to beat the sun, the sunlight here. It's going down. I have a nail of the day, and this one is from Chanel. This polish here is called Profondor. It's the number 638, and it came out in this fall's collection, 2018. This is a, a part of a limited edition line, and it came out alongside the red one. I didn't end up picking up the red one. This one right here was the color that was mostly appealing to me. But let me show you guys a difference in packaging here. This is the regular packaging from Chanel. This is Fiction, by the way, which I just recently did a nail of the day for. Um, and this one right here is has a frosted glass and it has the matte cap. How beautiful is that? I love the packaging. I'm obsessed with the packaging. Obsessed not only with the packaging, but also with the color. So this is a very deep burgundy color. It has a velvet finish, so it does perform like a matte polish. And you have to work quickly, but smooth at the same time. Otherwise, the polish is going to drag. I did allow each layer to dry before going in with a fresh layer. Otherwise, once again, it's going to drag. For me, this leveled out and got opaque at three coats. And even though I worked quickly, I felt like I didn't work quick enough. You can see in certain areas it doesn't look completely smooth. Um, it left some indentations in certain areas, but it's not something that's noticeable from afar. I just thought I would point it out. And because of the color, or it's the nature of, of similar colors like this, you have to be careful around the cuticle area, otherwise you're going to get some staining. Even after cleanup, I still have a little bit of staining. Once again, it's very common with colors like these, but it's something that I also wanted to point out. I picked my bottle up on the Nordstrom.com website and it retailed for $28. I did check today and it's not available there anymore, but it's still available on the Chanel site. Um, so if for some reason though, you're not interested in paying the Chanel price or it's not available anymore on the site, you can achieve a similar look with a similar color and maybe putting on a matte top coat. Uh, but quite frankly, guys, I think it's worth it. I love this. I love the velvet finish makes me feel cozy and the color makes it look super chic and sophisticated for the fall. I think this is great and highly recommend it. So that's everything for today. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you found this video helpful and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.